it's going to sound very weird, but your ex is probably the best thing that has ever happened to you, especially if you're looking for an understanding of where you are going wrong in relationships. Your ex is what the universe used as a vessel and it embedded the lesson that you needed to learn in that which you are attracted to. Because the, the universe knows what you were into. The universe knows your preferences. So if you're into guys with uh, wealth, if you're into guys with uh, you know muscles and tattoos, they're going to find the little minions across the world, wherever you are in the world, and they're going to embed a lesson in that person. Keep it in mind that part of what you attract manifests in its, uh, who you are inside manifests itself in the person. So with that in mind, they embed this lesson in this person, knowing that that person is going to be your ex. But they sit there and they wait for you like a teacher and they say, okay, cool. We've placed the lesson in this guy. Let's see if she's going to learn or is she going to blame the school and say, no, the school is wrong. And that's why you failed the lesson. I need to go to a different school, which is the equivalent of saying the guy, your ex is wrong. I need to go to a different guy. Every single guy will have the exact same lesson embedded in him because the universe knows what you need. And because you choose to deny what the universe is trying to get through to you, you will fail that lesson every single time you choose to throw blame to your ex and not throw blame to yourself as not knowing how to pass the lesson because you don't understand the lesson. And that is the, the only time you'll get to that point is when you supersede your ego and your pride and you say, I don't know. I don't understand. I'm not good at it. And realize in saying that you are only human. You are practicing your human right to be that which is positive and negative, And you might just have a flaw like every single human being. So do not sit back and say, Nathaniel, there's no way my ex is a lesson. Trust me, they are a lesson. And if you say I've had so many exes, it just showcases how remedial you are when it comes to relationships. Because that's how far behind and how repetitively and consistently you've been failing the same lesson. It doesn't matter who the vessel is. You've been going to school, to school, to school, blaming every single school but yourself because you don't want to admit that you have faults and you don't understand the lesson. It is only when you are open to understanding that you have faults that the universe can say, okay, if you are willing to understand that you don't know X, Y, Z, we will help you. But trust me, if you don't take time and treat the lesson like homework and treat your ex like homework and sit down in silence and use the alone time when you are single and not jump over into another relationship because you want to distract yourself from loneliness, understand in that moment you need to be raw and honest with yourself, supersede your ego and say, okay, maybe we don't know how to be in a relationship. Maybe the basis of, and the foundation of what we know about a relationship due to the bad um, example, whether it be a single parent household, uh, whether it be a, a failed marriage that you come from in terms of your, your parents uh, or not having any parents. Maybe because of those things that is not your fault, I don't know how to be in a relationship. And guess what? That just makes you human. It doesn't make you weak. Understanding that slowly helps you then work on this thing. It's like maths. You don't say maths is the, f the fault. You say, I don't understand maths. I don't understand maths. So don't, every time you fail in a relationship, you are choosing to, f all you're doing is choosing to blame the institution, not yourself. It doesn't matter who your ex is. The lesson will always be embedded. The only time a shift will happen in what you want truly in a relationship is when you understand what your faults are. Your ex is an example and the best motivation to help you understand what that is. Because your ex holds a mirror. And if you understand that, oh gosh, you will finally move forward. You would progress from this.
you will never fail that lesson again. It was hard for me and I ain't just like you. If I watched this video, I would have been like, there's no way my ex is a lesson. But upon my journey, upon moving above and beyond my, my, my pride and ego, I sat back and I was like, holy shit, I know exactly what I did wrong. And I thanked every one of my exes. Truly, I thanked them and I said, thank you so much. I've learned. I get it. I totally, totally get it. I see what I've gone, where I've gone wrong. I, I am the reason why everything went wrong. It's me, not you. And I thanked them. And it wasn't easy to do that. It was not easy. But Lord knows that if I did not do that, I would not know what I want and what I need now. It's a beautiful process when you can just brittle yourself down and accept that you are a foundation of positive and negative and just because you don't know doesn't make you weak listen to what i'm saying it is not a nathaniel thing it is literally what the universe is putting out there in the world if you move on into a another relationship without having taken the time you are going to fail the lesson again and you're going to continue failing that lesson in a marriage in a relationship, you'll get divorced over and over and again. You're going to end up having receipts of those failed lessons, which is your children. And then boom, 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 you're going to have a meltdown at some point and be like, what the fuck actually? And guess what? I'm going to send you this video and be like, I told you this five years ago, 10 years ago. It, it hasn't changed. Learn the lesson. Do the homework by yourself. Do not take and use loneliness and find distractions to prevent the loneliness because you don't want to do the homework because you are procrastinator and you are lazy when it comes to your own development learn the lesson put in the work be by yourself and understand that you are and have faults like every human being and if you have those faults find ways to better yourself at it like anyone who's bad at english who's bad at math you go practice this is a practicing thing. We're not going to all be perfect at relationships. Your looks has nothing to do with it. Learn the lesson. Stop failing every single year. Stop blaming the institution. It's you. Learn from your mistakes. You have the potential. Trust me.